Internet 101. Have you ever been scrolling through social media or streaming your favorite TV show and wonder how it all works? You can use the internet to access all types of content and information. An internet service provider like Comporium connects customers to the worldwide network. The modem in your home allows you to tap into this network. A router allows you to have Wi-Fi throughout your home, connecting all your devices, like your computers, cell phones, gaming consoles, and smart TVs to the internet. Broadband and bandwidth. You may have heard the terms broadband and bandwidth used to describe how the internet works. Sometimes these words are used in the same way, but they have different meanings. When talking about the internet, broadband means the same thing as high speed. Broadband internet service means that one wire is able to carry several channels at one time, delivering faster internet speeds to customers. Bandwidth, on the other hand, is the amount of data that can be carried in a given time period over a network. It's usually measured in kilobits per second or megabits per second. You'll often see this used to describe the internet speed that a customer is receiving. Internet speeds matter because the faster the service, the faster all your devices can run. With broadband internet, you'll be able to access social media, streaming music, streaming video, online gaming, and online video conferencing without delays. You'll also be able to upload and download files quickly, making it easier to work and learn from home or share photos and videos with friends and family. Wi-Fi. Another term that's often misunderstood is Wi-Fi. Many people use Wi-Fi and internet interchangeably, but they are two different things. The internet allows you to access information from other computers around the world. Wi-Fi allows you to tap into the internet and share that signal to wireless devices throughout your home, like your phone, tablets, and video games. Wi-Fi bands. Wi-Fi operates over different bands. Each band is used for different needs. The 2.4 gigahertz band is used for Wi-Fi, but a lot of other things as well. Things like older cordless phones, garage door openers, and baby monitors. This band uses longer waves and can give you better range on your devices, especially if you have a lot of walls or other objects in the areas where you need coverage. However, because so many devices use this band, it's more congested. This can cause dropped connections and slower than expected speeds. The 5 gigahertz band is much less congested which means it provides more stable connections. You'll also see higher speeds. On the other hand, the shorter waves used by the 5 gigahertz bands makes it harder to penetrate walls and solid objects. It's also got a shorter range than the 2.4 gigahertz band. Of course, you may also be able to improve that shorter range by using range extenders or mesh Wi-Fi systems. Wi-Fi is an amazing technology that makes it convenient to access information anytime, anywhere. But like everything else, it's not perfect 100% of the time. There are things that can make your Wi-Fi seem slow or keep it from working as well as it could. These include lack of coverage, which means the Wi-Fi signal isn't strong enough to reach the exact location where you are. Wi-Fi interference, meaning other networks or devices cross paths with your Wi-Fi or if other people join your Wi-Fi network without your permission. Email. Email is still one of the most popular reasons people use the internet. Whether for work or for play, email helps us keep in touch and helps us manage our personal and professional business. Unfortunately, spam is one of the unpleasant side effects of email. Spam is an unwanted email message that arrives in your inbox. Often, these messages contain scams or viruses that can damage your devices or steal your information. If spam becomes too much of a problem, there are some things you can do. First, you can train your spam filter, meaning you receive a spam email, you move it to your spam folder. Eventually, your email will learn to filter real emails from spam. Never respond to spam emails. 
You can also opt to hide your email address in your email settings. You can use a third-party anti-spam filter. If it does become too much, you can change your email address. Scams. Being aware of scams can help you protect yourself, your personal information, and your financial information from criminals on the internet. Scams are everywhere online, not just in your email. Here are some warning signs of scams to look for on websites, social media, or anywhere. It involves money. It sounds too good to be true. You're pressured to make a decision in the moment. There's an element of fear, or you're being asked for your personal information. Passwords. Oftentimes, criminals are looking to steal your passwords to important websites so that they can access your bank accounts, credit cards, streaming services, or other confidential information. Fortunately, there are steps you can take to keep your passwords and information safe and secure. Create a strong password for each website you use. This is one of the best ways to protect yourself. Password managers tied to your web browser or device will help you keep track of all of your passwords and will generate strong passwords if you run out of ideas. Using phrases is another good way to keep your password strong. It may be easy for you to remember, but hard for other people to guess. Passwords alone sometimes aren't enough. Many websites now require two-factor authentication or multi-factor authentication. For example, you may enter your password on your bank's website, but then must enter a code that is texted to a mobile phone that is verified to belong to you. It's always a good idea to turn on this authentication when it's available. Antivirus. Make sure that you have reputable antivirus software installed on your computer. Most computers have some type of antivirus program installed on them when you purchase them. If you must download this software from the internet, make sure it is from a trusted source. Our online help center has detailed steps on what to do. For more information, or if you have any questions, we are available 24-7 at Comporium.com.